of a field of wishes And whatever I wish I may I will live like a king, I'll do everything And never work a day I hope you wish for sharing And to love with an open heart For the good that you do will come back to you And then your life can start Now the world is waiting Just for me to try Make me proud, Pinocchio And never tell a lie all for me and all for free They never live in harmony In sisterhood and brotherhood The way the real children should The boy to get a maid out of wood Once upon a time, there lived a woodcutter named Geppetto What are we going to do, eh? One day, while sitting by the fire one of the logs magically fell from the fireplace at Geppetto's feet. I think maybe you don't want to go into the fire just yet, eh? Well, what would you like to be? So, people don't buy my things just now, then you, I, make for me. So Geppetto made a boy out of wood to keep him company. In the morning, Geppetto awoke to find his wooden boy was gone. As if by magic, the wooden boy was able to walk and talk. He had run to the market and, like all new little boys, had gotten himself into trouble. Oh, no, you don't. <laughs> he ran back into Geppetto's shop to warm his feet by the fire. Who's talking to me? Well, it's me, the cricket of the house. I run this place. If it weren't for me, this house would be a mess. I keep things in order for your father, Geppetto. You couldn't find a better man. <sighs> he has a heart of gold. Oh, and what do you do to spoil his plans? You run away just as fast as you can. But, uh, but there's a lot of things to see and do up here. Oh, all in due time, my young friend. All in due time. You can't just run here and there with a burst. Why, even a puppet has to learn a few things first. I do. Like what? Like what? Well, like how to think and how to read. Even a little dummy like you needs to know how to care for people. Oh, no! There you are. I thought I'd lost my little one. No, no, no. Don't cry. You're alive, my boy. That's a miracle. <laughs> but, but I lost my feet. Oh, don't worry about that. I can make new feet for you. You're alive and safe. That's you the only thing that made new feet counts. for the puppet and gave the puppet a name. I feel like a lucky man. So I am going to name you after the luckiest man I know. His name was Pinocchio. Goodbye, Papa! And the next you. morning, Pinocchio left to go to school with the money Geppetto had gotten will, by Pinocchio. selling his coat. I know you will. Oh. There was much to see and do in the world, and it was easy for Pinocchio to be influenced by the strangers oh, he would soon the meet. Dark, Pinocchio, old chap. Well, yes. How'd you know my name? Because, my little wooden pal, we heard your father calling for you. P -p -p Pinocchio. Ah, <laughs> oh, yes, he was shivering. Poor man didn't have a coat to wear. You wouldn't happen to know anything about that, would you, Pinocchio? Yes, and I'm going to buy my papa another one as soon as I get home. With these. <laughs> Utterly fascinating story, I'm sure. I say, I've got a Tremendoropolis idea. We're going to take you to the Field of Wishes. Ever hear of it, my dear chap? <laughs> and so the fox and the cat took well, Pinocchio no to the to Field waste. of Wishes. Not to help him, but to steal his, his money. The field of Wishes. Well, I should meet my papa first. 
buckets of gold coins, Pinocchio. All for free, little buddy. All for free and all for me. Let's go! We have to Back at the stay. workshop, Pinocchio Geppetto had built a wooden ship to, to search for his lost little boy, Pinocchio, I mean, who had not come home as he had promised. Ha, and here we are, Pinocchio, the field of wishes. Bet it's not what you expected, is it, little buddy? No, it's not. Trap and take a shovel there, that's right. Dig a little hole and drop in your little coins. I'm on a roll. Take this bucket, fill it with water from that stream way over there. Then come all the way back here. <laughs> While at sea, Geppetto and his wooden ship were suddenly swallowed by a giant whale. It seemed now that Geppetto would never see his wooden son become a real boy. Back in the village, Pinocchio was tired and thirsty. He stopped an old woman and asked her for some milk. Back at the cottage, the old woman revealed to Pinocchio that she was really the blue fairy who had given Pinocchio the magic that made the wooden boy come to life. And so Pinocchio tried hard to go to school, but once again, temptation got the better of him. I'm going to dance land. Hey, you want to come along? Be daring, be a man. Well, why should I wait to be a real boy tomorrow when I can be a man today? Now you're talking, Pinocchio. No, Pinocchio went to Dunceland with Candlewick and the boys. Dunceland was a wonderful place where boys were free to play all night and all day and eat all the sweets they could eat. And so Candlewick and Pinocchio, like all boys who went to Dunceland, became donkeys who were trained to perform in the circus. Before long, Pinocchio was made to dive off a high board into a pool of water. That little donkey! And was forced to jump through a hoop of fire. But when Pinocchio failed, he was tossed from a cliff. Don't be afraid, Pinocchio. I haven't forgotten you. Thanks to the Blue Fairy, Pinocchio was able to escape, only to find himself in the path of a giant blue whale. The same whale who swallowed his father, Geppetto. Is anybody else in here? Papa! Pinocchio? Pinocchio! Oh, Papa! Oh, my boy. I looked and looked for you. I thought I'd lost you forever. Papa, I'm sorry I ran away and made you worry about me, but I'm here now. Oh, that is so sweet. But where are we? This, my son, is the belly of a whale. The belly of a whale? We gotta get out of here. Oh, but how, Pinocchio? Well, I got in when the whale opened his mouth, Papa. So, the next time he opens up, we'll both just swim out. Come on. Bye. Bye. Oh, it's just a little farther. We can make it. Papa, we can do it. Oh, we made it, Papa. Please, don't be angry. You're a good boy. And so Pinocchio saved his father, and for his reward, the Blue Fairy gave him what he wished for, to become a real boy. What happened to me? Thanks, Whiskers. Who's this wrong? For the real boy with the kind heart. Love, the Blue Fairy. 
Thank you, Blue Fairy. And thank you for making me a real boy. Like your Uncle Popeye, you will have to learn about them. Boys, this is the famous quote that George Washington couldn't have crossed the Delaware without. Jake. 
pick this up. Oh, Popeye! <laughs> Puts up your dukes, you see, Wolf. <laughs>
I'm just as plain and simple as you can plainly see. That's why I'm plain and simple, as simple as can be.
Allah, a lollipop. Simple as can be. 